Hi students, in this video, let's discuss the fourth question in the GMAT quantitative review and after we discuss this question, we will make a similar question. Now do remember to subscribe to this channel and comment below I subscribed and let me know what problems you are facing or just tell hi and I will personally reply to you. Let's get started. Now in the fourth question, it's mentioned that the volume of a ball is 32490 cubic millimeter and we are asked to find what this volume is in terms of centimeter cube. Alright, so that's the question. It's a very basic question. But remember, you need to get these questions correct and you need to get them correct quickly. Alright, so over here, we have the unit cubic millimeter. Now we need to convert it into centimeter cube. Now what does cubic millimeter mean? It means millimeter into millimeter into millimeter, right? So we also write this as millimeter to the power 3 or millimeter cube. Now, 1 millimeter is equal to 1 by 10 of a centimeter, right? Why is that so? That's because 10 millimeter is equal to 1 centimeter. Now, if you divide the left hand side and the right hand side with 10, you get over here 10 by 10 and over here you get 1 by 10. Now, this cancels out. So, you get 1 millimeter is equal to 1 by 10 of a centimeter. So, instead of this millimeter, let's write 1 by 10 of a centimeter. And let's do the same thing for these two parts also. Alright. So now over here we have multiplication happening. So let's do that over here also. So in this way you can see that 1 millimeter cube which is what we have taken over here is equal to 1 by 1000 of centimeter cube. Right. Because 1 by 10 into 1 by 10 into 1 by 10 is nothing but 1 by 1000. Alright. Now we need to convert 32,000 490 millimeter cube into centimeter cube right and we have just found that 1 millimeter cube is equal to 1 by 1000 of a centimeter cube therefore these many millimeter cube will be nothing but 32490 into 1 by 1000 centimeter cube right so that gives us the answer now in the denominator if you're dividing by 1000 right so you just need to move the decimal point by three places to the left so currently in 32490 the decimal point is over here right because this number over here is the same as 32490.0 right so these two numbers are the same one and the same now you need to move this decimal point by three places so that's one two and three so it will reach over here that is when you divide 32490 by 1000 you will get 32.490 and that is in terms of centimeter cube that gives you the answer so the correct answer to question number four is option C. All right. Now we have learned an interesting concept. Now to solidify this learning and to ensure that you will never make a mistake in these type of questions. Let's quickly make a question of our own. So I just take a random big number. So I have 93870032 and let's say this is in millimeter cube and let's say I want to convert this into meter cube. In the previous question, we were converting this into centimeter cube. Over here, let's convert it into meter cube. Alright, so again, 1 millimeter is equal to 1 by 10 of a centimeter. We have already seen that, right? And let's go ahead and instead of centimeter, let's write meter. We know that 1 centimeter is equal to 1 by 100 of a meter, right? So for this part, I am replacing it with 1 by 100 of a meter. Now, why is this? It's the same logic. Over here we have 100 centimeter is equal to 1 meter. You divide both the sides by 100 and you get 1 centimeter, right, is equal to 1 by 100 of a meter. So that's what I'm writing over here instead of 1 centimeter. All right. Now, when you do this multiplication, you will see that you will have 1 by 1000, right? That is, you will have three zeros in the denominator. Now, because we have millimeter cube over here, we have to do this three times, right? So we have to do 1 by 1000 into 1 by 1000 into 1 by 1000. So that will give us a number which has nine zeros, right? So it's one followed by nine zeros in the denominator. Now, remember the decimal point in this number over here is over here, right? So if you are multiplying this with 1 by 10 to the power 9, right? This is nothing but 10 to the power 9. You just need to move this decimal point by nine places. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. So the answer to this becomes 0 0.9387 0032 meter cube. 
all right so try to make one more question of your own all right so in this way you will never make a mistake in these type of questions do remember to subscribe to this channel and all the best in your preparation